Austin, tell our art friends what we're gonna draw today. Ladybug. Yeah, cartoon ladybug. We're gonna keep this lesson nice and simple, especially for young artists like yourself. How old are you? Six. Six, yeah. We hope you're gonna follow along with us. You got a marker or something to draw with and some paper. paper. We're gonna start by drawing our ladybug's eyes. We're gonna draw two circles and I'm gonna draw them right in the middle of the paper, but we wanna leave some space too. We don't wanna draw them right next to each other. Then we have room for the mouth. So we draw one here and one over here. Yeah, perfect. Another one. Good job. Now we're gonna draw smaller circles in the top right so that our ladybug's eyes look shiny and friendly. Yeah, and then we could draw a smaller one down here in the bottom left. Then we're gonna color in the big circle but leave these two smaller ones white. Now we can draw a mouth right in between our two eyes and I'm gonna draw it just like that. But you could draw it differently if you want. There you go. Now let's draw the body for our ladybug. We're gonna start right here and we're gonna draw a, it's kind of like a big U for the bottom of our ladybug's face. So we're gonna start here and go all the way over to here. Yeah, oh, it's a big face, I like it. Now we're gonna draw the top of our ladybug's body. We're gonna draw a bigger upside down U on top. Is that awesome? So we can start here, but go up a little higher and then back down. Yours is gonna be awesome because it has a big chin oh, and a big body. Now let's draw the top of our ladybug's head. We're gonna start right here. We're gonna draw a curve that goes over and then back down. Yeah. Then we're gonna draw a line right down the middle of our ladybug's body, and that's for the wings to separate. There we go, good. Now what's on top of the ladybug's back? Spots. Spots, yeah, let's draw. We're gonna draw three on each side. I'm gonna draw them like this. One, two, three. Yeah, and then one more. And then let's repeat that over on the right side. One, two, three spots. So if you have three on this side and three on this side, how many do you have total? Six. Yeah, six, good job, you added three plus three. Now let's color in our spots. All right, dude, what's our ladybug missing? His legs. Yeah, our missing legs. So let's draw three legs on each side, just like we did with the spots. We're gonna draw a sideways U, it comes out and then back in. There's one, and we're gonna draw another one, two, and then one more, three. And if you guys at home need extra time, what can they do? Pause the video. Yeah, you guys can pause it if you need extra time to finish a step. Now let's repeat those same shapes over on the right side. We're gonna draw one, two, and three. So how many legs do we have on our bug? Six. Six. Three plus three. Good job, dude. We did it, we finished drawing our ladybugs, except we're missing one thing. What do we still need to do? Color it. Yeah, it's gonna look so much better colored in. We're gonna fast forward the video, but you guys can pause it at the end to match the same color. Ready to fast forward? Yeah. Austin, good job, man. I love how your ladybug turned out. It looks super awesome. Now, it's okay that our drawings look different, right? Yeah. And our art friend's drawings might look different too, but that's okay because the most important thing is to have fun. Yes, to have fun and to practice. practice. And we'll see you later, art friends. Goodbye. Goodbye. If you had fun following along in this lesson, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking the circle. Then you can click the bell to get notified every time we upload new videos. I've also picked out these two other lessons I thought you'd really enjoy. Don't forget to take a photo of your child's finished artwork and share it on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter because we want to see how awesome it turned out.